Hey guys, thanks for joining me on this video. This is going to be part one in a series um, testing the Lemon RX stabilizer. It's a pretty neat little stabilizer that I uh, admire quite a bit. First off, we're going to test it here in the Fun Cub, and next will be the Bixler. And to be fair, um, in this video, uh, the video to come, I didn't exactly control the uh, airplane as well as I could have when the stabilizer was off. So take that with a grain of salt as you watch this video. Thanks. Okay, so here's my plan. What I'm going to do is uh, take the airplane off and go for two passes with the stabilizer on. I think I'll do two passes with the stabilizer off. And once again, if you look at that windsock, there's not a stitch of wind this morning. Everything looks great. So I uh, wish me luck, guys, and uh, hopefully you gain some information from this pretty cool uh, stabilizer, the Lemon RX. Thanks. I can tell you guys right now that uh, the stabilizer is making me a much better pilot than I am. I tell you, uh, even in these calm winds, I mean, there's actually actually in no wind. But really, you can see the wings of the Fun Cub kind of moving around a lot. And also on that landing, I mean, I didn't use any flaps on that landing. I probably didn't need to. Uh, it was probably a little rougher landing than I should have had, but I need some more practice with my flaps. But I think the evidence is pretty clear that um, the stabilizer just makes me a more confident pilot. Sure, I can turn it off when I want if I want to do some, if I want to try to be a, a real pilot. But the, you know, this this airplane, it doesn't self-level itself as nicely as uh, uh, like a Bixler or something like that. But the stabilizer really doesn't help with that. It just helps those unwanted movements uh, that are that are pulling on the frame uh, necessarily. So I really. Um, I can't say enough about this little device. I mean, you get it with, I think it's maybe $18 or $19 for uh, the receiver and the stabilizer all in one unit. And if you want to add in the satellite receiver, uh, it's, it make, brings the total cost up to like $24, which is unheard of, really. I mean, in these day and age of $80 and $90 receivers, which is just unnecessary. So. This is 7 Demo 7. I hope you guys had a great day. I had a nice flight on my way to work here, and I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Cheers.